हे गाइज आई एम शुभम एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई सीरीज मेकिंग एप्स दैट ऑटोमेट थिंग्स सो द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज दैट वॉट सर्विसेस रियली आर एंड्रॉयड सर्विसेस इज अ कंपोनेंट दैट इज चूज टू परफॉर्म ऑपरेशन इन द बैकग्राउंड लाइक वी कैन प्ले म्यूजिक हैंडल नेटवर्क ट्रांसक्शन also um, for interacting with content provider we can use android services and android services don't have any user interface and and android services keeps on running in the background indefinitely even if the application calling it destroys in our application why services are important it's because if the user selects hundreds of contact then we can't perform the long ongoing operation on the main thread that will simply make our app to hang and yeah it may crash too also as services run in the background we don't have to worry about keeping our app live so let's see the structure of the services when we click on the send sms button in our app our app will send all details including a uh, list of numbers and sms to the services using a start service method this method simply start the desired service then there is a method called on handle intent which will handle all further processing of the task but do you know services can't update the user interface like we can't uh, send toast in the service so how we are going to tell the user if a particular task is going or not we use their broadcast manager consider the broadcast manager like a postman who sends a message from one person to another on handle intent method in the service will simply perform the task and keep sending update to broadcast manager and the broadcast manager will broadcast received updates and then in our activity we can use broadcast receiver to receive all the updates and then we can notify user however we want like we can show notification we can just show toast there like that so in the about the theory now let's see how we create service programmatically so in my last video we created until that in this video for creating a new service we will just click right click on our package name and then we will create new service there and uh, let's give it some name like i give it a uh, send sms service Just let's uh, short it down to only SMS service. So after that, this is a predefined service will be created. Now we need to uh, change it according to our needs. So there will be, uh, yeah, see, there is method on handle intent, and then there is a uh, on handle intent. Uh, call to handle action so we will just refactor every other parameter over there to according to our needs so there we require two actions first will be to send sms and second will be for sending whatsapp sms so like that we will change this to actions refactor these two actions so we require three parameters here so we just give them name like message count and third one is a list of uh, contact numbers we will just give it name mobile number and then we have here two helper method so we will just refactor their name to according to our needs like start action send sms and start action send whatsapp and then we need to change their parameters to like context message 
अकाउंट एंड मोबाइल नंबर मोबाइल नंबर विल बी द रिजल्ट दैट वी गॉट फ्रॉम मल्टीपल कॉन्टैक्ट पिकर बट थिंग इज दैट वी कैन रियली सेंड कस्टम ऑब्जेक्ट इन इंटेंट सो वी नीड टू क्रिएट सम अरे लिस्ट ऑफ नंबर लाइक स्ट्रिंग अरे सो दैट वी कैन पास इजिली पास दैट स्ट्रिंग अरे इन द इंटेंट एंड सो दैट वी कैन जस्ट कॉल इंटेंट सर्विस सो टू कन्वर्ट आवर कस्टम ऑब्जेक्ट इन टू नॉर्मल स्ट्रिंग अरे वी विल जस्ट initialize a number list in which we will add all the numbers we got in that result using a for loop that we uh, did it in our most of the videos so now we got a list now just initialize a string array and then it's very numbers dot to array that will change your list to array now we will just pass that number array to our intent first will be message that we get as argument second will be count and third will be array array of all numbers that's it and now we will just call start service method like we discussed before now just uh, refactor that method to start action send sms now let's copy this method and change it for whatsapp to so just change the its name start action send whatsapp but the remaining things will be exactly same yeah the one thing where we need to change action to action whatsapp action sms to action whatsapp now we will change our on handle intent according to our methods like we require three parameters so we'll just make here three parameters we have message count already we will just add third one there third one will be string array of mobile numbers so intent dot get string array extra now we will change that variable names so that it will be more uh, understandable yeah just copy paste same below for whatsapp and then handle action who and handle action bars we will refactor them like handle action sms and handle action whatsapp Yes. Now in our main activity, we already wrote the code that will send SMS. We will just copy paste that code in here so that we don't have to just write again and again. Okay. So currently we have array, so we will change that custom object result in format of array. Like array don't have is empty, so we will just. use length there 
if length is not zero, zero then go into the loop there numbers in square bracket g that's what i need to write there and there i need to write message as we talk we can't really um, put toast in service because it doesn't really work so we need to create broadcast so let's create a method send broadcast message with argument message let's initialize broadcast manager to initialize broadcast manager we need to give their intent one of its as one of its argument in action you can write whatever you want to write We'll put our message as a extra in that intent. Now it's time for calling broadcast manager. Local broadcast manager dot get instant this dot send broadcast and then just give intent as a argument. That's it. So we we'll just call that send broadcast message wherever required. Yes, we will send there. Uh, let's call our service in this on click listener button. We we'll just remove our old code and call to the service like my service my sms service dot start action sms and then context message count and result yeah, that's it now we will create broadcast receiver here so that uh, we can just take all the broadcast let's create some variable to string variable for getting that intent and we will just show that result in the toast format so user will be get notified whenever there is update now we need to register that uh, broadcast receiver in this activity so that uh, so that it will work Don't forget to write exactly same action as we uh, as we code in our service. If you write there something else, then it won't work. You need to write the local broadcast manager like in the previous. register broadcast receiver yeah 
the same variable that we create below and the second argument is intent no it uh, don't really take intent it take intent filter so we will just change intent to intent filter it just uh, easy thing it's not really big a task and that's it we will just pass that intent there let's see the output my prank message let's select the contacts click on play button count yeah now send sms yeah it's showing the toast that means our service is working perfectly fine So we'll just make small change there. We are just showing I. We need to add one into it so that it will look good. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. If you found this video very much helpful please click on the like button subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon so that whenever i upload new video you will be get notified and in the next title we will be talking about how to send multiple whatsapp messages to anyone over a single click of button